What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. We're here again with another abandoned video. What you're seeing behind me right now is an abandoned bed and breakfast. This place was built in 1903. Uh, they later renovated it in 1988 and then it was abandoned in 2011. There's a lot of crazy stuff in there. We hear that there's like a dungeon in the bottom that actually is like a like a jail cell almost like. So we're gonna go down and look at it and we're gonna explore this whole place. Gonna get some cool drone shots. But before we get into it, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and leave a like. Let's get right into it. Okay, so upon first expression, this place is huge. It's even a freaking chainsaw. Guys, yeah, so we're gonna take our first steps inside this place. Look at how small this doorway is. All right, guys. So I'm I'm six foot seven, and this is this, this is not practical at all. <laughs> so another thing about this place is there is a five thousand volume library here, which that's what we're in. Just the front entrance of the the bottom door. You come in and you see so many books. So it's got these nice, like, stone stairs. Look how detailed that is. It's crazy. So this was the kitchen, or one of the kitchens. They are, they got all the stained glass. This one has pineapples on it. Green beans. All right, we're gonna take you guys through this floor. And then after there's another upstairs and then there's another part that's downstairs. So we're gonna check out. Was this a bathroom? Yeah. Oh, look at that. I have like velvet curtains for a shower curtain. Really? Oh my gosh. Look at all, look at this wall right here. It's covered in newspapers. Gosh. Wow, it's so retro. Guys, <laughs> these stairs look insane. Like they look at like they're in really good condition still. This one looks crazy. They're like the little angels on there. All the stained glass just looks really good too. Like, there's stained glass throughout this whole house. Come here. There's some pearl necklace in here. Pearl necklace? Yeah. What even is this? This is so cute. I don't know what that is. Maybe like a plant above your bed? I don't know. I bet you that's exactly what it was. Yo, the tree growing inside the house. There's really no rain damage, really. You guys see these, see these cabinets right here? They're freaking boats. And behind them, it looks like what they would use for like storage. Now look at the stained glass in here, guys. That looks crazy good. Is that a sliding door? Oh, wow. Maybe they hidden things over here. No, but this is a cushion right here. I definitely think this was like a master suite. This would have been like the master because it has the, the tub, the bed, and, and like the living room right there. So another one of the of the activities that these this manor offered was it had an exotic petting zoo and exotic uh, like garden that you could walk through and everything. 
So this place is actually definitely one of the coolest places I've ever been to, if not the coolest place I've been to. I read up a little about it and it had a hot tub, there was a waterfall, there was just so much stuff that this place had to offer and it's so sad to see it run down like this and trashed and vandals have come and ruined a lot of things. But guys, this is awesome. This is for real awesome. All right guys, we're gonna head up these uh, pretty cool looking stairs right now. We're gonna see what's up there. There's a bed up here. There's one room. Do a lookout for there. Oh, this is super cool. This, this was a bathroom up here. Look at this little light that they have right here. You got an awesome view of outside. So this upstairs part was very, it's kind of small. Like and the ceilings are really, are really low. So like a person like me would have to have gotten a, a room at one of these other places down here. Okay guys, there's another upstairs right here that we're gonna check out. What are these lines here for? <laughs> <laughs> They're probably, it's probably like a linen. They hang clothes up right here. Okay. There's some more rooms. Like a closet. It's a really big closet. Maybe a walk-in closet. Hey, there's another door over there. Oh, he's okay. oh dude. This is really Honey, nice. Look at this. Does it go into the bathroom? It goes to a room. A different room. Oh, wow. Look at that. Why is that on the ceiling? I don't know. That's crazy. Dude, this is like... Look at all these old magazines. Ew, poop. Crazy guy. Like I, uh, again, there's more like stained glass. Guys, look at this fridge. Oh my gosh. Oh wow, that's sketchy. Jay, you want to be the one who walks across it? Yeah. <laughs> sure. This looks like almost like a Japanese type of thing. Like, what, what would you call this Japanese though? Is yeah, that the, the, uh, the pink blossoms? Yeah. That's cool. It's like a theme. From what I hear down here is like a dungeon underneath these stairs, which it could have been like because this could have been like the like the kids' play area. So since it's all themed, this could be like a like a pirate theme or something like that yeah, because you walk across shit. this bridge. Yeah. And then you come down to the dungeon down here. Is that not creepy? <laughs> and we're gonna walk back over here. Yep, see you guys? This would have been where you get locked up. There's a bunch of tapes in there. This is crazy, I wonder what's on all these. This saying is on a lot of stuff. Believe and receive, doubt and do without. All right guys, that's the end of today's video. We got to explore this awesome giant bed and breakfast today. 
If you enjoyed the video, hit that subscribe button down below. Go ahead and leave a like on the video and stay tuned for more abandoned videos. Big Banks out.